Jordan Sarkar and I am an L&D professional and I uh, run a company with my partner uh, which is uh, into uh, learning and development. Uh, we organize trainings for corporates. Uh, one thing that we lacked uh, was how to understand psychometric assessments and undertake psychometric assessments. So the basic expectation was to have a basic grounding. Um, the certification uh, would obviously help us approach clients to say that they are qualified to now conduct assessments and uh, give away feedback. And secondly, we, we found that when we went to clients uh, to exactly identify a training need or uh, identify a gap was proving to be difficult if the client did not have uh, earlier data. Uh, so we thought that uh, possibly this would, uh, these tools would help us analyze what are the gap areas that training that are required for training, so that we could customize a particular training for a client. Uh, so these are the basic expectations. I think uh, the three days have matched more than my expectations for this particular training. Uh, simply because, uh, one, I uh, really like the idea of having uh, some robust pre-training material that was given to us. Uh, usually, it is some of the other trainings that I have attended to get certified, it has not been so robust. Uh, and there was a clear, uh, the entire content of the pre-work material was, had a lucid flow in itself. So it had, you know, proper direction to saying, you know, you do this, only then you do this. Or you read this particular model and attempt this particular thing only after you have attempted. Mm -hmm. So I think that, that really set the tone uh, and created curiosity. Um, I think Vijay was fantastic in terms of trying to link a complex subject and statistics done some amount of statistics in our MBA programs, but I wish we had Vijay when he was teaching us statistics there, <laughs> I think better off uh, learning the concepts. Uh, so that has been fantastic. His ability to link real life uh, incidents to assessments uh, and how do you evaluate the assessments has been very good, uh, which has set us thinking. Uh, and I hope that in the next 30 days that the time is given to us, we are able to uh, you know, use and implement his knowledge and get certified, I think that can be a true uh, indication of how well which has taught us. And uh, so, so that, that's the thing. I, I, I don't think right now, I think there's any gap uh, in the training functioning. Possibly some may feel that more time could have been spent. Uh, given the fact that there is a 30 day window to again revise it okay. and hopefully have also access to him. Yeah, yeah uh, absolutely. And some more yeah, so yes, yeah. Uh, will obviously help us uh, do this. So I don't think there is a gap uh, here at this point of time. Maybe because I do a lot of more experiential training, um, I would have felt that maybe some more activities would have helped, but I don't think there is a gap in these three days per se for me. So thank you very much.